I've been running. I would like to welcome you all on behalf of myself, Nicole's mum Kay, and Darren's mum and dad, Brian and Christy, and to thank you for taking the time to come and celebrate this very special and happy occasion, the marriage of Nicole and Darren. And I think you must be pretty special indeed, because they've asked you to be here, to share their joy and their happiness, as they take these important steps, together publicly declaring their love and their commitment for each other. What a beautiful place it is to have a wedding. It was Nicole and Darren's vision and it's came true. It looks absolutely stunning. So quite simply, it's going to be a wonderful day. And it's our privilege to be here to enjoy it with them. Darren is a well-mannered, kind, generous and caring young man and we have come to realise how much of a genuinely nice person he is and what a great son-in-law he will be. For eight years now you've been a part of our family and we love you very, very much and I can honestly say I think of you as the son I've always wished for. Every father knows that one day his daughter will find a partner, fly the nest and get married. Every father also wishes his daughter the best of luck and worries about her finding the right man, one that will make her happy and look after her. We've no doubt in Darren she has found that man. <laughs> <laughs> I, Darren Keyes. I, Darren Keyes. Accept you, Nicole Stewart, in marriage. Accept you, Nicole Stewart, in marriage. As my lawful wedded wife. As my lawful wedded wife. And do you promise to love her, honour her, and protect her? For better or worse, for richer or poorer, in sickness and in health, or forsaking all others, be faithful, faithful to her as long as you both shall live. You can I say do. I do if you want. I do. <laughs> I was, I, was trying, I, was, I was trying to remember all that. <laughs> come to realise how special Darren is to Nicole and the way they look at each other, the way they speak to each other, there's a genuine love there that will last forever. And it's with that in mind that I today pass the mantle of looking after my daughter to Darren. As much as a cliche as to say, I actually feel like the luckiest man alive to be able to marry my best friend. I can't wait to see what the future holds for the two years. 